you know, not all music has to be like that, but that's definitely how I feel called to create art. The introspective bag. The introspective bag. In my introspective bag. <laughs> What I, what I really resonated with, you know, from the first time you played me the song, um, is the transparency and the vulnerability. You know what I'm saying? That's what drew me into the song Scattered and just some, some of those lyrics, especially with seeing your notebook and feeling like those lyrics had jumped out of the notebook, you know, like saying face and, you know, the voices of demons, they don't like me, you know, that. I just resonated with that. Um, I mean, you attacked your verse so beautifully. I feel like. Thank you. Yeah, I just I'm so grateful that the vulnerability spoke to you because I feel like that's something that, you know, people need. I feel like you know just when they listen to music, feeling artists like express their actual truth, um, and that not always being just pretty and pristine and um, sexy. You know, like sometimes it's a little nasty. Sometimes it's a little dark you know and I, I appreciate the fact that you were able to like really bring that to the table as well through your verse because it matched you know the energy you know my mission is like I've come to realize that when I speak about the myriad of mental issues I go through and I speak about them honestly and um, with no shortcuts that not only is it a catharsis for me it's also valuable for the world you know what exactly. I mean it's valuable for other people because so many people are going through you know the same shit the same especially right now especially right with now. all this shit going on definitely I think that's why God kind of put everything on hold for me for so long was because the world wasn't really ready to hear this kind of introspective energy you know like it, it was like now is such a perfect time I feel with what we're all going through to have that music that people can listen to and you know maybe it's not just entertainment for them but it's something that will help them feel less alone and help them feel seen you know and like they're not necessarily going through these motions and just by themselves you know that's something that i feel you on that being like the mission with the music like that's definitely mine as well is like through the process of like the catharsis or the personal catharsis i know that there's others out there who resonate with that and who are able to see themselves in that and therefore heal a little bit more. And that's, I feel like, what I've always loved about music is that ability to resonate and, and really grow from it. And, you know, not all music has to be like that, but that's definitely how I feel called to create art. The introspective bag. The introspective bag. In my introspective bag. <laughs> so, you know, I was, I was thinking, I was just thinking about how your journey, personally, from what you share with me, and, you know, your um, unfiltered and unafraid seeking of healing is, is, is so extensive. Um, and you have reached a lot of points of healing, but this record is dope because it's representing the things that you have been healing from, right? Right. You know it's saying? like, it's it, that's actually kind it's of... Not hopeless, you know what I mean? Because right. in the context of everything you're doing... Right. It's like, I need help. I don't feel like myself. Like, it's I'm, that's literally what the chorus is asking for. It's like, I'm, I'm trying to get out of this mental rut, you know? And you, I was actually talking to myself this morning in the mirror, and uh, <laughs> I was just like, bitch, I'm so proud of you, you know? Because... I didn't like self-sabotage myself to a point where I wasn't able to show up as my full self today, which is what I usually do when it comes to like important moments in my life. Like I'll go, like I'll see it approaching and then I'll be like, ah, and I'll run away and I'll fuck myself up. You know what I mean? Like whether it's like not having smoked in 10 days, like for me is like a major thing, you know, cause I'm smoking all day, every fucking day. <laughs> but like being able to really like make that decision inside of myself of like you know what no like this moment is so important to us and like us being me and myself <laughs> and like um like i'm gonna show up for you like i'm gonna show up for you this time so it's that juxtaposition of what scattered's talking about which is scattered is talk colors and scattered are talking about like me not being able to show up for myself because i'm so lost in the dimensions of the demons of my mind so being able to bring that to life though like and actually have a, a visual representation of that that was something that i dreamed about and i'm just so grateful that i was able to bring that to the table but yeah i appreciate you recognizing grateful to you for you know bringing me on board yeah no thank you thank you for saying yes <laughs> you did. introspective bag hey <laughs> <laughs>